Riders in front of the Liberty in second. We're on the inside green fence by the head and down the back. The three map leaders are one, two, and three. That's zero power through the feet. And the green fence starts the front as they go. And up front the four is going to be now in overdrive on the outside. Picks up the running and swings the power behind. We're going to be up front by coming back again. And the line, six, five, one, and very low. Well. Well, the No, I bought a move, uh, saw him racing in a sprint race in Enniscorthy and Martin Stafford owned him and we haggled with Martin and we bought him and John Cavanagh has all our dogs and he does a great job with him so Johnny had his eye on him as well so he went from there, I suppose he started A3 and we got him into open class and he's after running great races in Dublin, open class we sent him over to the Derby in England and he got injured a couple of days before it, and that was a heartbreaker so he got injured in the Champion Stakes final Niggling injuries, but uh, we could do it a bit of luck with him, and hopefully now is our time to get a bit of luck with him. So. Um, it was a difficult heat for us because we had three in the race and uh, you know you just hope they all get around safe and he broke quite well uh, the three dog went in and hit our two dog which was General Wolf and uh, he got a nice run into the bend after that we were obviously pleased to get two qualified I uh, thought the bits ran very well nearly got up for second hopefully we we won't meet each other next week we've got three left in it and we're just hoping for the best Ruthing Archie, Greg Skino, all in. Hot as all the way and racing up front, one on the inside, the smart down with two now taking the early lead as they go down to the corner. Champagne Jackie gets around as front from Dan Viking in second. Six mid division breaks, Kino followed by G on the inside, Joy Van Royale. But up front with Champagne Jackie leads, the favourite Dan Viking is beginning to wind up for a challenge back in second. Tree Joy Van Royale is playing to the cards, they're home and far, they're heading to the judge, and two and three up front, they go for the line. Um, she's um, we bred her ourselves actually. Well, Dave Harrington, she has the mother for us, so we breed her and we get half the litter each. And uh, she was very promising from the word go. Now, to be honest, so he kind of. My husband Chris was kind of mad about her from the word go, so he said he'd keep her for breeding. So um, we always knew like that she was very good, you know, coming from behind. And then about about three weeks ago, she did 28-11 here from behind. So era, you know, we're delighted with her now, you know. But hopefully, like she can do more than that. But it's, it's kind of a hot lard, I suppose. But we're delighted anyway with her. Uh, the mother is by Droopy's Cruel out of uh, Top Award and uh, she had a litter from Honda Black and uh, one of them won the um, produce stakes and the other one actually uh, won a stake up in the north. Uh, we had two dogs, Honda Blacks, so they were fairly good and the mother now has gone too old so we're going to breed her now. Drive on Royal, so.
No, uh, we got him from Glennon's and uh, he's, he looked very good and he took a long time to get to himself and uh, we're getting a bit doubtful about him and uh, Morty is very friendly with the Dunphys and the Dunphys says give him a few sprints and it might get his confidence back because if you see him he, he's edgy in the box but he was missing his break and, that, and uh, he won a couple of sprints then, he won a sprint in Shelburne, he ran a good sprint in Clanmel and it seemed to get his confidence back. And then we gave him an unofficial in Kilkenny one night and he did a serious run. So we began to think maybe things might go better from there on. Like, you know, and he's gone well since he got, he ran in Shelburne, he ran three times in Shelburne and we were getting fed up. But I said, look, we'll take a chance, it's only one large and we thought this place might suit him. He won his first round then, 28, 28, 18. And what did he do tonight? 20, 15, yeah. But the inside is the, is the answer, you know. He's, uh, he's out of Lemon Bell. She has the track record in Limerick for 600. She still has it. Her little sister, uh, Lemon Reese, has the track record in Drumbo Park. And uh, she's, just a, she's just a good brood bitch anyway, like, you know. But all Lennons, I have to say, they have a great line of dogs. And, uh, well, I'm just lucky to have a fella now. I'm after ringing him <laughs> around my son there. And... Uh, he said, look, at, I said, I, we might get through. So I rang him, we won. Yes. He didn't believe it, but anyway, look, at, it's all a dream, isn't it?